side is faithful. So we're painting the windows outside. Painting the windows outside now. God is... Hang on a minute. So God is moving, hallelujah, praise the Lord. We're, re we're literally coming to an end uh, of this project and we've even started receiving people. Look, we've got someone, even though the, the uh, water will be um, connected today, we've got people already in, people are living there. That's how big the demand is. Got someone already living there. Someone just moved out of there. We accommodated that one for a few days. Uh, Jesus is moving and um, we're literally coming to an end. And even though the electricity and the water has not been connected yet, people, God is sending us the, the right people, people in need. People who want to follow Jesus, people who want to become disciples of Jesus, people who want to stop the drugs, people who are homeless, people who are, who are, who are. And uh, it's amazing how God is moving and he's sending us everything we need at the right time. The, the donations, the, someone donated the fridge, someone donated the, uh, a washing machine, someone donated the kitchen cupboards, kitchen cupboards there. Someone came and, and fixed them, volunteered and fixed them. Uh, someone donated the sink. Uh, we got volunteers working outside. God is truly moving. God is amazing. I tell you, this is the hand of God. You will see. Hello. What's he say? Hurry up. You will see. Huh? Is it nearly finished? Yes, it's nearly finished. It's nearly finished. God is moving. No, the men are moving. Yeah, and God is moving the men. Now you're moving them in. Uh, and God is moving me. <laughs> See? It's looking nice. Yeah, yeah. This is, the, this is the hand of God. I tell you, the Holy it's Spirit will fall nice. down in the neighborhood of Isianis. I'm just making a video, sorry. So God is moving. God is, God's hand is literally moving in the neighborhood. Huh? I need God to do some moving on my house. Pray. <laughs> Look at the house from far now. And it's still, we're still, still not finished. Can you compare to what it was? I mean, we, we barely had walls before, all right? But it's not really the image of the house. It's what this house represents. It represents Jesus. This house represents Jesus. It's all for the glory of God the Father. And this house has the Holy Spirit moving in it, through it, around it. And it's what this house what God will do through this house. It will take those in need, the homeless, the addicts, refugees, or anyone in need and literally put them on the right path and turn them into disciples of Jesus. Jesus says, go out and make disciples of all the nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit and teaching them to walk in my instructions. And this is exactly what we're doing. We read the Bible and we follow the Bible word by word. We follow in the footsteps of Jesus Christ. If Jesus did it, we're going to do it. If Jesus didn't do it, we're not going to do it. We're literally following in the steps, the examples of Jesus Christ. Jesus came, he was an example for us to follow. And that's what we're doing. If Jesus says, feed the hungry, we're going to feed the hungry. If Jesus says, shelter the homeless, we're going to shelter the homeless. If Jesus said, love your neighbor, we're going to love our neighbor. Jesus says, love your enemies. We are going to love our enemies. Jesus said, treat others how you want to be treated. We're treating others how we want to be treated. The Bible says, do not lie, do not steal. So we have to stay away from those things. You know, we're literally, we're literally following in the ways of Jesus and we're teaching people, people that most of the world just completely disregarded completely tossed to the side no those are the people that we want jesus came for to save the darkened souls of man and so these are the people we want the religious leaders went to the disciples of jesus and said why is your master sitting with the the sinners and then jesus reply was uh, i'm paraphrasing but jesus's reply was it is, is it is a sick man who needs a doctor not those who claim i am well i am well i am well 
and so we want to reach out to the people that feel that they've just lost all hope lost all faith there's no other path for them in life we want to reach out to those people and we want to tell them that there is hope and his name is jesus christ